How often do you think about your heart health? Are you aware of the risks of cardiovascular disease? Well, let's dive into the heart of the matter. Cardiovascular diseases, encompassing coronary heart disease and stroke, claim the top spot as the leading cause of death in the United States. Particularly at risk are Blacks and Hispanics in underserved communities. It's a sobering reality, isn't it? But there's good news. Cardiovascular disease is largely preventable. Stay tuned to learn how you can keep your heart beating strong. Heart Smarts, a health program, is here to empower you to live a heart-healthy lifestyle. This program is not just about information, but about transformation. It offers a comprehensive approach to help you understand and achieve heart health. Heart Smarts is committed to reducing the incidence of cardiovascular disease, the leading cause of death in the United States. The program focuses on underserved communities where the risk of heart disease and stroke is greatest. Through education and empowerment, HeartSmarts aims to turn the tide on these statistics. It's a call to action, a call to change, a call to live healthier, longer lives. HeartSmarts is about arming you with the knowledge and tools you need to make HeartSmart choices every day. It's about the power of prevention and the promise of a healthier future. Remember, HeartSmarts is not just a program, it's a life-changing journey. It's about taking control of your health, one heartbeat at a time. But don't just take our word for it. Listen to these stories from people who have benefited from heart smarts. Imagine being told you're at risk for heart disease, a leading cause of death in the United States. Now picture having the knowledge and tools to combat that risk head on. For people like Maria, a single mother from an underserved community, heart smarts was a beacon of hope. The program informed decisions about her heart health, ultimately, ultimately, reducing her risk of cardiovascular diseases and then there's john a middle-aged man who was once a prisoner of his poor lifestyle choices for him heart smarts was not just a program but a lifesaver it opened his eyes to the risks he was taking and gave him the push he needed to commit to a healthier lifestyle these are not just testimonials they are life-changing stories stories of empowerment resilience and triumph over heart disease these are real stories from real people who have seen the impact of heart smarts in their lives. Are you ready to be the next success story? Your heart health is in your hands, and with heart smarts, you have the power to make a difference. It's time to take that first step towards a healthier lifestyle, a step that could redefine your future. Heart smarts is not just an ally, it's a beacon, guiding you to make informed decisions for your heart health. So why wait? The path to a healthier heart is just a click away. You'll find the link to Heart Smarts right down in the description below. Start your journey towards a healthier heart today with Heart Smarts. I am here with Miss Allie from the Giggling Pig, which is an art studio for kids from toddlers to 10 year olds and more. And more. So, can you tell us a little bit more about the Giggling Pig and what it is? Yes. So, the Giggling Pig is an art studio in Bethel, Connecticut, and in Shelton, Connecticut. Um, we uh, have camps, birthday parties, all level art classes. Uh, we try to make each child's, sorry, that's my son, each child's experience fun and bright and loving, um, and we want to brighten everybody's day. Okay, so with your son here, his mm -hmm. name's Logan, say hi, Logan. Hey. Hi. <laughs> uh, can you tell us about what's the benefit of art? On toddlers, yeah. like him. On toddlers, there are so many benefits of art. <laughs> um, art in toddlers. Art in toddlers is for exploring, creating, uh, learning. At that age, it's all about touching and feeling and experiencing your surroundings and socializing. Uh, but then there's older kids, like we can go to five-year-olds, six-year-olds, and art has so many uh, benefits there as well. Uh, so about the touching, the experiencing, and feeling, yes. the hands-on stuff, uh -huh. what do you think is one of the best art types for little kids? I love acrylic art, um, but also sculpture and clay. I know you want to call. Um, they get to create, they get to use their hands, um, they can really explore their environment. They learn, oh, if I use the clay and I move it this way, then it makes this or that. Um, so that's definitely important.